The story of Episcopal worship in Loudoun Valley begins with the Reverend Sewell Hepburn. Born Samuel Sewell Staveley Hepburn in 1845 in Kent County, Maryland, he was the fourth of five children to Sewell Hepburn and Martha Maslin Hepburn. At the age of 20, Sewell entered the Virginia Theological Seminary in Alexandria. The year was 1865, and seminary education activities had just resumed after being closed down during the Civil War. He was ordained a year later as a member of the very first post-war graduating class. During his first decade as a priest, Sewell Hepburn planted churches in Virginia and Maryland. In 1870, he landed in Loudoun County and spent the next four years planting the first Episcopal churches in the region, beginning with Christ Church in Luckett's and then St. Paul's Church in Hamilton. In addition to fathering Episcopal congregation, Hepburn started his own family. His wife, Selina, had five children in eight years. Their first two children, both sons, were born in Loudoun County in 1872 and 1874. The very first meeting of the future St. Peter's Congregation happened at the Catoctin Free Meeting House in Paonian Springs in September 1871. It is that event that we now celebrate on this 150th anniversary. Hepburn eventually left the Loudoun area in 1874 to briefly serve in his hometown of Kent, Maryland. He then came back to Virginia to serve in Hanover County before once again returning to Kent, where he served intermittently until 1926. The Reverend Sewell Hepburn died in 1932. Thank you for watching. And please tune in tomorrow for our next episode of St. Peter's 150.